Hello. Everyone, this, we're here with 99 percenters and oh my goodness, this is a seed. It's pure dark matter, hun. I love it. Oh, yes. Give me pure dark matter, hun. Dark matter. It's literally just dark matters. That's all we have to do. Nothing else. And go fight Zoromas. So good. I love this. Edge start, dark matters. Let's go. Okay. I need to make sure those things are visible. Okay. I do love the fact that this is just Dark Matters. Basically means Sylph Cave and Moon are probably not required. I mean, it might be required for, like, Zoromas access, but it's probably not required for that. Let me double check what the actual... YAML is. Like what weights are in the YAML, because it's been a while since I've looked at this. Okay, so we have Dark Manners. One of the other objectives hit. And it's not win game. Obviously, we just have to be collect the dark matters. Uh, case summon is a decent chance of on. Moon is probably off. Crap is, yeah, I don't know. No free has a chance of being on. That's fine. Uh, P key is definitely on. Okay. P shop has a very small chance of being on, and P chest is potentially on. That's fine. I'm just like confirming things for myself. I mean, I don't really care about the loot. I'm gonna loot everything. We'll deal with whatever idea I have. But... Right, it is Warp Life self back row. There's a small chance self glitch is off, which I kind of find amusing. Vanilla Traps is a good chance of being on, actually. We should make sure that I take a look at that. It could be wacky as well. Yes, okay. Oh, this will be fine.
Let's get the seed started, though. I've looked at the YAML enough. This will be fine. How bad could it be? It's just a bunch of dark matters. Edge and Rydia. Think Queen Ambulin giving me a tower key, a bunch of garbage, a trap kit is, I guess, cool. No wacky. Got a tower key. King Queen Ambulin are up by again, which doesn't really make a difference. Uh, I got 99 prisoner robes, which are basically useless, so cool. So, it's time to start looting. Loot Goblin time. Let's go. Loot Goblin. Hang on. That feels too wild. I feel like Power Shirt there is very strong. Or wildish. Oh, and the Artie Bow? Yeah, okay. Where are the Dark Matters, though? Show me Dark Matters. My goodness. <laughs> Heroin robe in there. Wow. Okay. I am concerned by the lack of Dark Matters. I know there's gotta be, like, there's 45 of them out there, and we're gonna find 30 of them. Okay, there's a dark matter. We're gonna destroy it next. And I'm gonna do a sort of little loop do thing that I like to do with dark matters in Troya. Not gonna check Cave Magnus, not gonna check Zot itself, but I'm gonna check all the other things in the area. Uh, maybe not the back of Troya. The back of Troya is very long to get to. Probably not worth it. And key is on. Okay, no free key item is on, so I may have to check some bosses for D-Mist. It's probably not important. Key items are not as important in this uh, mode, because a lot of the key items just don't gate things. Uh, Luka Key, Hook, and Baron Key are the big ones. I mean, Earth Crystal too, to some extent, for the treasury. But there's really not that many gating uh, key, key items that gate treasure chests that could have dark matters in them. Like, the tower key does nothing for my dark matter count. It's just an extra key item check I can make for other things. And really the biggest uh, thing to find is underground access, because that opens up just so much. Uh, no, I don't want to leave now. I'm going to go up and loot the Chocobut and the Chocobo Forest. Chocobo down here. Hourglasses. Okay. Um. 
Um, we have plenty of hourglasses actually. I'm not going to worry about shopping for things because it's too wild very clearly. Let's do this, then we'll hit mist. Both the cave and the village, probably. Not super worried about characters because I have uh, too much power. Don't care about Evil Wall, Evil Wall just dies. Like, whatever. You are confirmed. By that 100 GP. Grab the Dark Manor out of Mist Cave, then we go into Mist Village, loot this, loot the village out. It's just how to be as efficient as possible while looting. Uh, back of Troya is very out of the way, and I don't like doing it. Other things, eh, we'll grab stuff. I think it might be max tier 6 on this loot, which isn't the end of the world. I'd like an exit caster before really diving into watery pass, but I could just get an exit caster right here, so. Characters, I mean, I do want the cane. Honestly, I'm fine fading the three chests in the middle of watery pass. We'll loot front and back. Kane is good, I do want him on my team, especially with that white spear that we found. And of course as we go we're also going to get loot for Edge and Rydia and all that. So. Yeah, going to skip the three in the middle. I don't really care about them, they're kind of really out of the way. I tend to selectively skip chests and hope that they don't bite me. Like the very middle of Watery Pass and the back of the of Troya, the town. Maybe I go back for them if I'm just a couple away or something, but... Rosie in the bed. Good info. Item shop. Gotta check you. Apples are available. I'm not going to go apple strats this seed, I think. Even though it's probably possible. I know free characters are on, so I'm going to get tons of characters. I kind of hate this chest, but I'm going for it. Of course it wasn't worth it. I hate that chest in particular, it's just so out of the way. 
Like these two are based are like less out of the way, I feel like, because there's two here and it's the same walking time, basically. But yeah, I feel like that's a reasonable clear of Watery Pass. I'm gonna leave the other three. There's three more boxes in Watery Pass. It's very unlikely that it's more than one Dark Matter in there. I'm not really that worried. You don't need every Dark Matter. You only need two-thirds of the Dark Matters. Uh, the chances are pretty good that there's a Dark Matter behind the boss here, so I'm going to potentially try to take it on. White Spear, Black Belt. Uh, Samurai. Ninja. Probably get a better shield for you. At least protect you a little bit. Is this worth fighting for the... Yes. T wild on, I'm gonna go ahead and wipe you up. I want my dark matters at the top of my inventory just so I can see how many I have. We're gonna swoon proc all the dark imps to death. I should give Edge his ninja sword. Didn't even need to swoon proc because we one shot. There we go. Couple levels already, uh, not a huge deal. But there's a very good chance that there's at least one dark matter back here. Not in those two chests. By the next. Chests. Nope. No dark matter. Gosh dang it. Oh well. We tried. There's a pretty good chance for each area to have a dark matter based on the random the randomization. Now we go into Damsian uh, to get any dark matters in the basement. Gotta open all these untrapped boxes. Inventory boss is going to be a thing. At least the dark matters are stacking up. Okay, uh, we don't have a weapon for you, but that's fine. Yes, you can get in my party. We'll probably find a weapon for you. It is S Wild. I can probably sell enough stuff to get a weapon for you if I checked weapon and armor shops. Honestly, that's probably the play. Means I should go back to Kaipo to check those shops. Yeah, I didn't check the weapon and armor shops here. I don't think I checked them in Troya either, or Mist. Definitely didn't check mist. I'm uh, mostly weapon shop, that's all I really care about. You're not selling anything super super good, we'll pass. Because I will have enough money for everything. I probably already have enough money for a crystal sword, and that's gonna be plenty. If I find an Excal, do I just go and take it and leave? I don't know. I'm not going to buy anything there. I've already got an Artemis Bow. I've already got a White Spear. Like, for most other characters, I wouldn't care. About shopping around for tier... For tier 7, 8. Most characters, eh. But Cecil just doesn't have anything that's below, like, tier 7. 
that's like worth really putting on him. This tier eight stuff is tier seven eight stuff is too valuable. Uh, we're probably not using Yang, so I can probably get rid of Poison and Cat Claws. I think it is Cell Quarter, which is limiting me a little bit. But we'll pass on the Masamune. I don't really need it. Not that good. Good, just not that good. Royal Lady. Oh my gosh, Troy Lady. Hey, Troy Lady. She's so annoying. And to Silvera, because I'm kind of nearby. There's three boxes here. And in general, it's a good idea to just check more areas because, you know, there's ch odds are good that there's a dark matter in most areas. In the cell quarter, I probably don't have a crystal sword in my inventory right now, but like in terms of money, but you can get there. Things are definitely something I want. Swing up to Hobbs Antlion area. Because there's a bunch of chests in this area that I would like to grab. And then I'll probably swing towards ordeals to get that done. Okay, Rydia. There's Indra. Should just learn the Asura summon, get it out of my inventory. It's gonna cash it in now. The best thing I can do with my good stuff is equip it to get it out of my and not taking up slots in my inventory, basically. And so then I have bad stuff and replace it with bad stuff that I can ditch. From here, I can sell. Probably. Two Dark Matters on the back of Hobbs. This is why we check back of Hobbs. That was two. Two Dark Matters for free, like just sitting there. Is the Hobbs character worth it? Probably not. I'm gonna say no. We'll probably see a white mage somewhere else. That's back row for edge. And a better weapon than the assassin dagger, so... Full moon is great, and uh, dolls we never have to fight, so... There's dolls for a forum up there. We'll do this first, though. Now, Antlion Cave. Let's get all the things from Antlion Cave. First of all, a lot of money towards funding a potential Holy Sword. Headband's actually just useful. I got one exit for here, one exit for Cave Magnus if I want to go there. So it's really not a great play. I don't want to have to sit through a lot of cutscenes, because it's just cutscenes, really. I don't know. You can use a black sword for a bit, I guess. We're still just trying to get money for a crystal sword, potentially, or Excal, depending on what's available. And, you know, Dark Matters. <laughs> More Dark Matters are always good. Edge is, like, fine. I would 
like the Masa, but it's not urgent. Uh, Kane is also fine with White Spear. Bye, my one Zed. Like, that's just a really quick fight. With Full Moon, especially. Okay, useless key item. Still a key item. I'm not gonna complain. Because if I do manage to build up to 10, then that's double experience, but it's not gonna open anything up. Up to 11 Dark Matters. Uh, Fable is not worth fading, really. Although I should just do ordeals. Just do ordeals. I'm gonna check Mysidia, actually, because Mysidia has characters. I know there's characters in Mysidia. Let's grab the characters in Mysidia. And check this weapon shop and item shop. Nothing I super care about in the weapon shop. Uh, armor shop, do you happen to have anything like super good? No. Okay. I mean, it is S wild. Anything goes. There could be Adam armors. Adam armors are a bit expensive, I think. We got a hundred thousand ish gold, so we need about another hundred thousand or so to get uh, next year. Yang is probably not going to be sticking in my party. I think I'll have Rosa. I think I'll take Rosa instead and go full vanilla. Full vanilla final party. I'll grab his gear though. I think the fire claw stacks something in the leather shirt will just sell. Means I need to go to a shop soon. Probably after ordeals. There's not that many items on ordeals, there's only five items, including this Chocobo Forest, so. And the Chocobo Forest is just 20 gold. Fine. Quickly heal you up. You're probably the only one who needs it. I'll probably want to take the black sword off for money. No. Get the dark matters off of ordeals. Who's the character on ordeals? It's another cane. I don't really want a second cane. I'm good. I don't even care to clutter my, my inventory with his item, with his gear, it's just not worth enough money. Second Cecil I would consider. Second uh, Edge definitely is high on the consideration list, but uh, second Kane, no thank you. Okay. So we're good on inventory space. Uh, guards would be easy enough. Gosh dang it. Swoon! Go Edge! Edge landing those swoon procs. Okay. Power up everyone in this party. Let's get some spells, please. I mean, Rosa can definitely turn into an archer. Honestly. I had good arrows. I don't really want her going first, actually. I don't want her going, like, taking turns fast right now. Uh, we should be fine here. I have enough uh, damage with Edge and Kane, I think, if I swap back to the full moon. Come on, Kane. 
Kane just needs a swing here. Pretty sure that's all I need. Yeah. Double damage from Edge and Kane is good enough for this spot. Goodbye, Plague. We're doing this basically just to get Cecil online, not because it's actual, like... I mean, it could be Underground Axis as well. Uh, Fabul and Baronin are also options. So... Oh. No Chira. That's good. Cecil, you're going to be converted into a Paladin now. I did not strip your gear, but that's okay. I don't think I really care that much. Luka Key. That's actually good. That opens up a lot more chests in the underground. Once we get underground, that's access to uh, the whole cave full of chests. So it's another place to loot for Dark Matters. There's probably a couple in there. Of course, it's not useful until we get underground, but it is useful once we get underground. Bye, Antlion. You're gone from the seed. Goodbye. Um, hmm. Where do I want to go now? Probably should sell some stuff off. I mean, of course, get down the mountain. Uh, probably go to Fabul to sell stuff. And check those shops. See if there's Holy Swords there. Uh, Agart could have Holy Swords as well. Kinda it for shopping. Yeah. Yeah, that is it. It's Fabul and Agart. We'll go to Fabul first. Uh, swing by the Chukpa Forest here. Just on the off chance it's a dark matter. Not a dark matter, but it's a dart. I could throw that for decent damage. Or I could sell it and get some money. Probably worth selling. It's 3,000. It's three more thousands towards my 200 that I, I'm going for. Or 215 for the price of a crystal sword. That's the goal. Buy a crystal sword somewhere. I don't need the gun here. I'm gonna be kind of aggressive selling things. I mean, we're probably basically there. Yeah, we're gonna get there. I think I can ease up on the selling. I don't really need a Murasame. Yeah, I'll be good without a Murasame. I'd rather spend the money on Ninja Sword or a Masa at that point. Like, if I'm gonna buy a Mura, I should just buy a Masa. Like a couple, uh, a few extra Thor Rages, uh, cabins would be nice, definitely. Spend the 10,000, it's fine. I'm only 30,000 away. Only 30,000 away from a uh, Crystal Sword. If I can find a Crystal Sword in a shop, which is also a thing. I have to find it in a shop first. Uh, Bahamut could also be in a shop, that's a very tempting purchase in this flag set. So far, it seems like probably not K-Trap. That's not a lot of damage. Oh no. Okay, you, you don't do anything. Cool. I'm okay with the star values. It's fine. Bye, Wyvern. Let's get Cecil a whole bunch of levels on this. Because that'll help out once he gets his Holy Sword. I'm making him stronger for when he gets his Holy Sword. Because I will track down this Holy Sword, gosh darn it. Okay, Rat Tail, not underground access. 
Defending Fabul does open up four extra chests in Fabul, so it's still probably worth it. Rat Tail is just a quick turn in for another key item, which I'll probably do for key item count purposes. Let's clear out Fabul. And it's just the three that I skipped in Watery, the four in Bacatroya, one little uh, thing in the grass in Agar, which I'll probably loot soon. Uh, Zod and, uh, and then Zod and Magnus, I think, is it, actually, for the entire seed. Or for the overworld, not the seed. I think I've looted everything else on the overworld at this point. Baron Inn is the way underground. So we're gonna wiggle our way down there. Don't think I looted the chug before us, so we'll grab that item. Dark matter. Ah. Take that. That's all the truck before us now. We're not gonna take this character. I'm gonna actually unload some stuff before I do Baron in. Because yeah, my bag is full. Uh, we don't need HP base J items. Purge my inventory of iron arrows. Get rid of honestly the soma drop can go. Archibo, heck that. Get rid of that, get rid of that. Oh, well, I think it might be worth buying. It is a setback towards the Crystal Sword, but I'll take it. Uh, keeping the Blizzard Spear for weaknesses, for weakness for elemental weakness exploitation, but we're gonna teach Rudy a Leviathan. It's fine. I don't mean that I can sell any future Leviathan summons back for more money. It only takes a few, and it's gonna be useful. I mean, this fight is just destroy Octoman with Edge. Who's the next boss? Wyvern's gone. Hippo guards, not scary. I mean, Rydia's got a Stardust Rod, so Leviathan's gonna be potent. Yeah. Leviathan's pretty good. Okay, Baron in done. There's a hook. And we had a rat tail as well, so we'll turn the rat tail in. That gets me access to on the whole hook rat chests and then underground chests beyond that. So it's definitely not bad. We're probably good to go on dark matters now. It's probably just find the access at this point. Then I get five key items. So we'll probably want to collect a few extras. I don't know. Definitely going to prioritize just getting underground now, though. Uh, I'm going to check aggregate shops before I dive the hook route. Just to make sure I'm not missing a holy sword there. Or a pass or something. I'll probably also loot Castle Eblin. Just to get the untrapped loot there. Uh, this is a chance of a dark matter. It's not, but that's the one chest in Agar. Looted. Uh, you've got tents. I like tents. Uh, you also can take my fire claws. I don't need two fire claws. Well, I'll keep some of the magnetization stuff. Uh, take this stuff at the bottom, though. I can part with the Dragoon Helm. 
Uh, I can part with maybe the heroin robe if necessary, honestly. Uh, why am I checking this armor shop? Check armor. Armor is irrelevant. You do have my holy sword. Okay. Uh, I need to find stuff to sell. Uh, Lilith Rod can absolutely go. Get out of here. That's worth a good amount. The Blizzard's Spear I'm probably not going to use. Uh, Silver Ring. Silver Staff. Get out. Crystal Sword. Go Burr. Okay. We're good to go. I am good to go. Heck, everything else. <laughs> I mean, I might still want to find, like, power shirts or stuff, but, yeah. Something, but, like, I'm basically good to go. I mean, extra money can go towards Masamune's for Edge, because Edge's weapons are not the best. Doing fine, just not great. We're gonna loot this, assuming that uh, it's vanilla. Glass hats are nice. I'll take them. I'm going to operate on the assumption it's vanilla traps until proven otherwise. I think that's a pretty safe play on uh, this flag set, on this YAML. Let's get some more money. I need more money for like J items and stuff as I go through, but Crystal Sword was very important. <laughs> Pretty sure Crystal Sword was a worthwhile purchase. So this is, and we're gonna just feed all of the stuff that I loot here. Basically, anything that I'm not gonna use is gonna get fed right into the shop in Eblin. For more money, I think it's probably vanilla traps, given that I haven't seen one yet, and I skipped the one test that was vanilla trap in Left Tower. That sword, that's an upgrade for Kane. Uh, so we'll put that on him. We're facts for back rowing Kane and Cecil, that's good. Like the silver knife. We don't need it. Um, but we are gonna slap the strength ring on you. 100% that strength ring goes on you. Uh, you need a defense sword. Well, you need dwarf axe and defense. Also gonna dwarf axe you. Do some swapping. I need to do some selling in Evelyn, but that's fine. Loot three boxes here. Yeah, I don't need Boreas. Heck the Boreas. Thanks for good luck, Alchemy. Oh, I want Zeus Gauntlets. Give me Zeus Gauntlets. Yes, please. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Give me the Zeus Gauntlets. Everything that I don't need, get out of my inventory. Uh... Heck that, heck that. Heck that, heck that. Already back row glitched, so I can heck that. Cecil, go more burr. Edge, I'm stealing this, I'm sorry. Cecil, go more burr. You can have this, and this, I guess. I need Cecil to go more burr. You want a curse ring, just to not have to worry about anchoring. Um, that sells for quite a lot. Yeah, let's get rid of that. Heck that. Curse ring. Do you sell any good weapons? No. Uh, actually, Thunderclaw. I'm gonna need to sell something for the Thunderclaw. Uh, Apple, get out of here. Oh, and Iceclaw. Let's grab both of those, actually. 
they're both useful. Got all the elemental claws now. I could want uh, Rosa. Get your iron ring off. You need to equip a diamond ring. It's glass hat. You glass hat. Ridia. Yeah, cure three is kind of useful. I'm pretty much done with money. Okay. It's fun, because this is just dark matter mo This is literally just a dark matter hunt. I should have tossed that diamond gauntlet. Uh, I can keep the extra grimoire. I, have a I already have a grimoire in my inventory. Wizard hat. Heck, wizard hats. I've got glass hats. That's fine. I'm gonna curse Rydia or Rosa for this hook route. The question. Army Rose. Is that good enough to get roses working? It might be. Give me the ribbon. I want the ribbon. Get the heck out of here, Mute Bells. Heck, Mute Bells. Now we're probably not doing Magnus. Like, get all this stuff the heck out of here. More Charm Arrows. Guy Hat, fine. Oh, it's T-Wild, yeah. Uh, it's Wild Max Tier 6, I think. But I bought a Crystal Sword, because it's also S-Wild, so I'm good to go. But it's a Dark Matter hunt, so I gotta loot everything. Okay, Edge, you can have the power. You may have the power. Hi! Hello! Uh, Rydia, I'm, just, I'm sorry. I don't think you're gonna stay on the team. I, I don't think Rydia's gonna stay on the team. Yes. Oh, yes. This is a seed. This is a checklist seed of find dark matters. Goodbye. I want all your gear, but goodbye. Welcome to the team, Fusoya. Uh, you need that. And why not that? Ditch that, ditch that, ditch that. Rosa, I think it's time. Rosa's going to go burr. It's also vanilla trap, so I can pretty safely just loot around all of the trap chests. I, th I think I have a party, though. I'm gonna say I have a party. Pretty sure I'm just gonna run this as my final party. <laughs> Why did I do this? I don't need this trap chest for any reason whatsoever. This was a mistake. You don't have stone. Or size. Oh no, you have size. Accidentally took this chest, it's fine. Come on, Rosa. <laughs> okay, I mean, the levels are gonna be appreciated. We need Ro- I wanted Berserk on Rosa. 
That's that's why I took that chest, definitely. And I suppose I'll take the Murasame. I will take it. It is an upgrade for you. <laughs> you know, we needed more edge weapons that were good. So yeah, I think I'm done looting. <laughs> I think I'm just done. I think I'm just done looting. Other than for Dark Matters. They're trying to give me heavy armor. Heck the heavy armor. I don't need heavy armor. I have Crystal Sword Cecil, Dragoon Spear... Uh, uh, not... Defense Sword Cane, and uh, Mur Mura Ninja Edge. With lots of strength boosting gear. Two power shirts, a pair of Zeus Gauntlets, a strength ring. I think I have a headband's bandanas on everyone. Maybe I have a ninja hat on someone, but that's still fine. Uh, Fusoya? I'm sorry. You're getting the cursed ring. <laughs> that's rude. Rude. <laughs> Doesn't even matter though. We're just kind of destroying everything. Fu already has nuke. I feel like I should mention that. Fu already has nuke. He's good. Oh no, it's Dr. Luke. However, will I get through this Dr. Luke fight? Edge, I'm gonna prep you for the second phase. Well, yeah, I don't need to cast Nuke fast. I need to Zerk fast. I've got three very good Zerkers. Except that Rosa can't land her Berserk cast because she has already Heroin. Oh, you did learn Berserk. Good. Who's got it? Who is going to be casting Berserk? Because Rosa's bad and missed it. Rosa missed her Berserk. It's fine. Yeah, everyone else is too fast and too good. Crystal Sword Cecil. Just Crystal Sword Cecil. That's this fight. I don't think I get the Berserk off. Uh, but it's fine. We'll be fine. Oh no, I don't get to Berserk. Whatever will I do? non berserk Crystal Sword Cecil just does 4,000 damage. Edge, can you hit, please? There's another 4,000 damage from Edge. <laughs> Beam just missed. I, I would like to appreciate the fact that Beam missed. Dr. Luigi just straight up missed Beam. Uh, I need to open the middle finger chest. Heck that Charm Claw. I feel like 50 minutes underground, considering I basically full looted every single area, is not bad. You know? Oh good, better arrows for Rosa. How do, I, how do I want to loot the underground? I mean, just kind of clear everything, I guess. 
I do need to make checks for the darkness crystal. Did I turn my rat tail in? I'm starting to think I may not have turned my rat tail in. I can't remember what it was. I'm gonna go with I probably didn't turn my rat tail in. Since I do need to make checks still, because I'm not in go mode until I find a uh, pass or darkness, I'm gonna drive right into the tower, I think. Also because tower will be easy. Uh, I'm gonna leave the trap chests alone so we can steal sirens if I need to. Hopefully I won't need to. Uh, Rosa... Yeah, you can keep those on, actually, because we're going to be up against that. Uh, you need to swap your Thunderclaw back for Ninja. I don't think I turned my rat tail in, but that's okay. This feels like the best place to go for key items. I mean, really, I should go for Paymar Freebie, but I'm right here. I want to swap my airship back. I'm gonna do it. Just skip all of these little internal rooms. They're trapped. Don't want to deal with those. Like poison axes. Why would I want a poison axe? Damage shield. No, thank you. Uh, mute arrows. Yes. Want more mute arrows. Dark matters, of course, are good. Realistically, I should go for freebies, but I'm right here. I'm making the tower get the tower play, and then we'll go check out like freebies. Probably not going to bother with dwarf. Dwarf is long. I mean, we can check it afterwards, but like it is two key items with warp glitch. Who does have warp? Self. I don't need self. So my best anti mage is Rosa, so we're gonna just be zerking Rosa, I think, here. I think this is just gonna be zerking Rosa and maybe zerking Cecil if I can. But mostly Zerking Rosa. Turns out Heron Robe, Artie Bow, Mute Arrow, Rosa is strong. <laughs> I want Mindy dead, I don't know why. Mostly, I'm too lazy to change my target. Go, Rosa, go! That's fine. Let's get Crystal Sword Cecil swinging. That's more like it, Rosa. Do 4,000 damage. Yeah, Cindy is very dead. <laughs> oh, hey, that's go mode, probably. Always keyless tower. I do actually want one of these. Just do keyless tower. It's the best way. Best, best way to finish a seed. 
That's that's my Z access. We're probably in go. I just need to loot a bunch more. That feels real good. <laughs> I'm gonna check Super Cannon just in case it's a pass, and I'm still gonna check my freebies, but like... That feels real good. Let me out. I wish I could have. I wish I didn't check Super Cannon. Instant regret <laughs> on the Super Cannon check. I mean, Fu will guaranteed survive, so Fu can just do whatever. And Rosa is immune to the hold. So we'll just give her Sammy arrows and get ready. It's an extra boss for Fu, I guess. Bonk on Fu. Rose is down, but I have Kane and Cecil. Yeah, on Fu. It's fine. I mean, this is going to be fine, it's just annoying and slow. And I'm already probably in go mode. Bye. Crystal Sword very strong. What do I want to loot? How do I want to loot the underground now? Probably dwarf to sealed cave to... Sealed cave's a pain to get out of. Hmm. I probably actually just go to self cave. Let's just go to self, loot that, set up shield one. No, I should check any key item. I should do fame arch before, before, before self. So let's do fame arch self. Tamra. Uh, well, Dwarf Tom Sealed probably is the best route. Because I don't want to loot Sealed, but I will. You know? Like, I will loot Sealed Cave. I don't want to have to loot Sealed Cave. It's kind of annoying to loot. Uh, I probably actually should route in Forge before that, uh, just to loot the Cocal Forge. But Tower is at least looted and done. No more looting of tower. If I get the pan here, I go straight to Sylph. Otherwise, you do Fame Arch first. Earth Crystal. I mean, I'm not gonna gun it for the treasury. I'm certainly not gonna cash that in. It should be Vanilla Traps, so I should just be able to loot my way through everything. Just don't hit the trap chests. I have no idea how many Dark Matters I actually need. Uh, we're at 21 now, so I still need 9 Dark Matters, but, you know, there's the whole Fame Arch, there's Sylph Cave, there's, uh... Okay, now 8 Dark Matters per go. Why did I do that? What am I doing? What did I do? Why why am I why am I dumb? Why did I why did I charge right into the warrior's chest? Uh nothing on this floor was value. I think it was second floor and then the third floor, and then that's it. Yeah, there was one here and one on the third floor. I don't need any of the loot, I just need the dark matters. Uh, 
Mura Ninja. Uh, like, and then a bunch of strength boosting gear, like power shirt, bandana, or something like that, and strength ring. He's doing well enough. I know Ma where Masas are for sale as well. I can't get anything better really than Mura Ninja on this. Yeah, no, and Kane's got a defense sword. But he's doing well enough. I'm gonna check the shops. Uh, mostly I'm looking for an Avenger here. I still haven't seen an Avenger in a shop anywhere. Hey look, it's an Avenger. And I sell like everything to afford this. Fifty thousand more is a tall order. Oh wait, I can sell this. Goodbye, White Spear. Hello, Avenger. Uh, give me a mute knife as well. I have an Avenger now. <laughs> oh yeah, they can totally be trapped uh, when the trap chests are shuffled. They're not for this rent or for this seed though, so I'm like, I don't care. I have an Avenger now. Uh, I do need some more money for uh, potential Siren buying, Siren and Bacchus purchasing. So I'm going to do a little bit more looting now that I sold off a lot of stuff for the Avenger. Like I will need more money. Crystal armor should cover most of it. Okay, off to Sylph Cave. Uh, we got a Magma Key as well. I'm at 8 key items. I'm hoping to hit 10 uh, for Shiva 1 Rat Tail. That's, yeah, that's the goal. That would be ideal. We're going to go the wrong way first, but just don't loot the Poison Treasury. Everything else along this path is fair game. Because uh, Vanilla Traps is on. Ooh, protect ring. That's actually useful. I think I'm done. Don't touch those chests. Those chests are bad. Those are all trapped. Because it's vanilla traps. I do not want to touch a trap chest at this point. Oh, I want the crystal ring. I really do want the crystal ring. Uh, heck that. Heck my grimoires and my Lilith Rod, honestly. Heck the poison arrows. Heck the shuriken. Heck that. Probably enough. Eh, I don't really need that. I have an Artie bow. Why did I take the Sammy bow? I already have Artie. Yeah, I still need more Dark Matters uh, for Go Mode. That's the only reason I'm still doing anything in this seed. I need Dark Matters. I'm going to set up Shiva 1 here. That's Sylph Cave cleared. But yeah, if you look at my total, I'm only at 25. I need five more. I'm gonna trust that Coco Forge probably has one. I'll go to Dwarf first. I'm not here to do Dwarf Castle, I'm just here to loot Dwarf Castle.
I'm also looking for a grind still, so I still want to find sirens somewhere in a shop. Sirens and or Bacchus. Either or would be great. Mm. Yeah, outside. Go around. Go up first. Over here. Oh, that's worth a lot of money. Yeet all the garbage that I don't need. Anything I don't need, just get out of here. Okay, that's probably enough money at this point. Uh, I do kind of want a strength ring. Take a strength ring for Kane. Kane still need, could use that. Dwarf is generally a pretty good place to loot. There's just so many boxes in here. That's Dwarf Castle looted in its entirety. Sirens are Tomer or Moon, I think. It's interesting. How many are we at? 27. Okay. Well, let's do Forge, and then we'll head to... Armor Sealed Cave area. Can't open that without the uh, Legend Sword, but... There's still dark matters here. I'll take the silk web. Got one dark matter out of forge. Tamra. Has some chests in it that are easy to get to, and then we'll head to head down the sealed cave because there's a bunch of chests in there. Sealed cave's just time consuming, so I was hope I'm hoping to put it off a bit. And it's more time consuming the further I go down. Inner dealer, okay. One dark matter in in the Tomer treasury. That's fine. Still one less that I have to find out a sealed cave. Down to two dark matters left. I'm not going to complete Sealed Cave. No, nope, nothing I care about there. I can afford one Zeus Gauntlet. Especially since I can now sell a Strength Ring. Heck, one, heck this spare Strength Ring that I don't need. Still got plenty of money. Amra, are you going to have my Sirens or Bacchus? Or both? Or neither? Heck yeah. I'm going to buy 20 just to be safe. Because I might need them. I might need all those Sirens. I hope not, but I might. Okay. Really hope doors aren't on. I don't think they can be, but. Before I do any grinding, I am gonna go check Sheila 1 and the Rat Tail turn in, because I think I skipped the Rat Tail turn in. So we're gonna check those two checks. 
to see if I can get 10 key items before I grind. And I'm just grinding. I'll peek the moonshot for Bacchuses, probably. Okay, no doors. It's going well. Right now, we're just trying to find the last couple dark matters I need. In Sealed Cave, of all places. This is intentional. It's not Rope of Shame. No. That's Door of Shame, though. One more Dark Matter. Uh, sealed uh, the, tro the Troya Treasury. I could go into Cave Magnus or his Tower of Zot, but... And I haven't done the touched the moon, but we're just looking for Dark Matters and I'm already underground, so Sealed Cave felt like the best option. We're go mode. Uh, let's get out of this room. Let's walk out of this room. Get out of here. That's go mode. That is our 30th dark matter, unless I miscounted horribly, which is possible, but I don't think I did. I did not. Actually, I miscounted the other way. I could have ducked out of there a little earlier. Oh well. It's fine. That's right, I was thinking I only got one dark matter between Forge and Tomra, but I got one in each place. So we have one extra dark matter, whatever. I spend a little extra time looting, oh no. Whatever shall I do? It's fine. I'm not going to complain about it. It's okay. We are in go mode. This is an extra key item as well. We're getting all the dark matters, so now I'm up to nine key items. So I just need Rat Tail turn in or Sheila 1 to be a key item, and then I'll grind. And then it'll be a nice smooth 10 key item grind on eggs, probably. And then yeah, we're done. After, at that point, we're done with the seed. Actually, do I want to go eggs or do I want to just... I have weak, I have... Maybe I just double go dragon it on the way down the moon. That's actually probably the smarter play. I have hourglasses, I've got, I've got weak, I've got hourglasses. Yeah, let's double go dragon this. Take my rat tail. That's a key item, we're good. I don't even need, care about the forge. Forge is irrelevant. I have a ton of hourglasses, let's just go for a double gold dragon grind. Even though I don't really have any dragon killing gear. It's fine. Actually, I'm going to check Sheila because it could be a pass. I know Piki is on. And if Sheila is a pass, it's much faster uh, than going through the whole thing. This is a purely a pass check. Yes, we do have weak. Oh my gosh! Oh my goodness, I love it! That paid out. Okay, we're gonna just do eggs. Because I don't want to go to the moon. I don't have to raise the big whale now. That's kind of bad, because it means that the whole going to... Uh... Doing tower was kind of irrelevant, but I have 10 key items. It's fine. Grind time. Also, this is absolutely going to be a quint fight. <laughs> oh, I need to like revive people and stuff.
I'm knocking down food just to prevent uh, first strike damage, because him getting first strikes would be annoying. But yeah, now it's just time to grind up to Z levels. As you do. I mean, Bacchus are on the moon, which means that the moon would be nice to get Bacchus wines online, but Fu's got Berserk will probably be fine. Oh, I can absolutely Zerk someone in the front row. <coughs> hmm. I could absolutely have Fu Zerk Edge. Yeah, Fu Zerk Edge, Cecil Toss Crystal. No, uh, I should have someone else in the top slot. Kane Toss Crystal. Rosa Zerk, in Cecil, Avenger Glitch. Cecil Avenger Glitch, yeah. And then we Silk Web. And then Zerk up Rosa, Zerk up Fu. That's gonna be my strat for the Z fight, I think. So I'll have to swap Cecil and Kane. Yeah. How high, how high do I need to go, really? Like, I've got Crystal Sword Cecil, and, you know, a couple other very strong Zerkers on this team. I'm gonna go a little bit higher. I want Crystal Sword Cecil to be hitting really well. Yeah! Oh yeah! Well, I'm not going 1200 strats. Like, why would I do 1200 strats with this party? This party just wants levels. This party just screams, do lots of damage. And win. Win by doing lots of damage. Oh, actually, I probably... Yeah, I put Kane up top with the, uh, swap him the Avenger, and then I'll have to zip manually Zerk Cecil if I do that. But yeah, that could work. Rose Zerk Cecil instead of Kane. Yeah, that actually, I, re I really like that plan. I get a little more HP on Rosa. We're probably fine. Yeah, I probably can do Z at this point. It's probably not faster to grind at this point. Yeah, we're not getting full, oh, multiple levels per siren. I'm gonna go. Uh, let's equip you with a crystal ring. Uh, any other hat? Nope, I sold all my other hats. That's fine. You're cursed, that's correct. Uh, we want to swap. You too. Kane's back row glitched, so it's fine. Everyone's back row glitched. I can sell all my remaining sirens, basically. For 2,000 each. And I buy a Masamune. Probably not. Is it worth trying? Yeah, we can probably get the Masamune. Edge needs more power. <laughs> Not sure that time was worth it, but, you know, we did it. Strategy is Berserk ed Edge right away. Yeah, Berserk Edge immediately. Um... Have Kane toss the crystal have Kane swap to the Avenger and then toss the crystal. Uh, which will give him Avenger damage, which is better than defense sword damage. Or close enough to defense sword damage that it doesn't really matter. He'll toss the crystal and then he'll auto Zerk. Because he still takes the he'll take that action and then the Avenger will be equipped on him for the next turn and he'll auto Zerk on his next turn. Uh, Rosa will Zerk Cecil. 
And then we toss the silk web with whoever's next. Probably. I think that's a reasonable strat. Just get people berserked as fast as possible. I'm pretty sure investing in a crystal sword was like the best big investment that I made this seed, just purchasing a crystal sword. In the accurate weapon shop. Uh, you. You need to get zerked. Uh, you need to take the Aegis Shield off. Do that crystal. Age is going burr. We already got a Zerk queued up for Cecil. Kane will start going burr after this turn. He'll be going burr for the rest of this fight. He's already got, like, set up for go. Edge buffering the turn. Fine. Go Cecil. Edge still not still buffering. Okay. Okay, we're ready to toss the Silk Web now. Hey, yes, sure. That's rude. Oh, you didn't, Zeromus. Oh my goodness. The exact damage on Rosa. I mean, this is fine. We're gonna survive, but... Zeromus just did literally Rosa's exact HP. No, the misses just mean he wasn't re uh, vulnerable yet. But now we have a decently solid Zerker team doing a bunch of damage every round per round. Rosa, get back up. Rosa, go burr. Go burr. Yeah, I wasn't really worried about it. This should be plenty of damage per round. Shake. Oh, we're done. <laughs> that was, that's how to beat Zeromus with uh, power overwhelming. Let's call it 123.56 because I was a little late on the done.
Oh goodness. So many treasures opened. That's dark matter, hunt. Uh, the flag set for this was no more dark matter, wreck all, wind crystal, K main, no free. E key, T standard, maybe, start edge, abilities. E wild, max tier 6. S wild, B standard, witch burn. E toggle, warp wipe, self back row. A 99 kit, which was prisoner robes, a uh, better kit, and a trap kit. Spoon flag was on, uh, Smith was super, and vanilla traps were on. He missed hiding in Baron Castle, jeez. Yeah, that was not happening. Thanks for the GG's Alchemy and K. Oh gosh, let's see what the music was. And what was in the treasury? We never got to see what was in the treasury. One dark matter. Two dark matters out of ten. That's how I'm gonna rate that, because none of the rest of that was useful.